Vermont earns hosting duties in the first round, making back-to-back -back appearances for the first time in 26 years. When the guys found out they'd received an at-large bid to the upcoming NCAA tournament, as you can see, they were a little excited, and who wouldn't be? While they had a good feeling they would get in, it's always better to have the selection committee officially call out the Vermont name. The defending America East champs from a year ago were unable to capture a second straight title, but they were able to prove themselves worthy as one of the top teams in the country. Their lucky 13 wins this year were the most the program has posted since equaling that in 2000, and the second best since they went to and hosted a national tournament game in 1989, when they posted an amazing 19-win campaign. This will be only the second time the Catamounts have hosted an NCAA game and hope to make the best of it tomorrow night. Well, I think we have to play to our strengths. I think we have to play, uh, I think we have a fair amount of team speed. Uh, we're pretty athletic. Uh, we attack, we want to continue to attack. Uh, our attack has to really take shape tomorrow night. We just got to play our game. Uh, our, play, our game is very simple. Keep the ball, move it, give it to, uh, to our strikers up top, let them score the goals. We've got to bring a lot of work ethic, a lot of communication, and just battle for 90 minutes. And if they do that, then they could be celebrating on this very field again. The big game will be under the lights tomorrow night at Virtual Field, 7 p.m. kickoff. Also